Hey everybody, it's Wade and Ryan for NFL in London. It's week six. Week six yep. games. Uh, we're doing all the games of the uh, Hippodrome Casino every Sunday. You want to come down? Ryan and I are talking about, uh, obviously, a game that's close to his heart. New England Patriots are uh, taking on the Buffalo Bills, New England. The new three-point favorites. Buffalo Bills, okay. So I'm going to let you go on this because it's your team. It's my what are you team. thinking? We, uh, listen, this is, this is my Super Bowl. This always is my Super Bowl because I don't have anything else usually to play for. But this is interesting. We got the Buffalo Bills coming off of Kyle Orton doing what all we wanted EJ Manuel to Throw do the for ball. the last couple of years. <laughs> it's just get completions to yeah. receivers. He's been able to do that. That was his first game. Basically, he came on the team in basically September. He had a great game, 300 yards. Bills haven't done a 300-yard passer in 28 games, and they did it in his first start. So I actually like the Bills in this. Uh, I think it's going to be close. Tom Brady always kills the Bills, and it, it drives me insane. The Bills have beaten them a couple times, but this is at home. This is the first game in the Pegula era. So the, the new owners, that they're, they're going to want it. The crowd's going to be pumped. This is actually going to be fun. I actually think it's going to come down to the last field goal. But I'm actually I'm going with my Bills. I'm going with my heart. Because that's what you got to do here. Tom Brady killed me. I might play him in fantasy against my Bills just to ease <laughs> the pain. But I'm actually going with my Bills. It's going to be a close one. But Dan Carpenter, 58-yarder last week. He's doing it again. I, I'm normally the voice of reason. Uh, and reason to me suggests actually the Buffalo Bills have a very good chance in this. Wow, and I think the Buffalo go. Bills, you're going to have Revis against Sammy Watkins. And I think that also the, the, the one thing you also have to look at is that New England has to play the Jets in four days after this game. they got to play them on the Thursday night no game. One's I think there was an emotional game last week uh, that uh, where New England beat Cincinnati. And, uh, you know, they were able to stymie it. It was some, a game that they had to look forward to. I don't think they're really looking forward to Buffalo. I don't think they've really thought of Buffalo. And I think that Buffalo's no pass D has been stellar. Buffalo has been stymieing the rush, so Ridley's not going to run anywhere. No. It's only going to be Brady to pass, and he has not been that confident in his passing. And if you really look at the game last week against Cincinnati, it was a defense. Yeah. It was a defense of New England. And I think Buffalo let their fans down when they lost to San Diego at home. That was a big game. They're going to be pumped. The crowd's going to be pumped. This is actually going to work to an advantage. I'm so excited for this game. Please don't be over by the first half. That's I, all I ask. I think Buffalo lets its fans down uh, by the fact that they have to live in Buffalo. We'll see you on Sunday. Yeah.